How to Virginize a Mercedes VGS 4 NAG2 Gearbox Using the Launch X4 31 ECU Programmer Hello, car enthusiasts and diagnostic pros. Welcome back to my channel, your ultimate destination for all things automobile diagnostics, programming, and beyond. Before we dive into today's detailed tutorial, I'd like to remind you to hit that subscribe button, ring the notification bell, and stay with us until the very end. If you find this guide helpful, a super thanks would be an incredible way to support the channel. Your engagement keeps us motivated to bring you the latest and most reliable content. So, buckle up, and let's get started with another exciting walkthrough. Launch X431 has recently launched its latest ECU slash TCU cloning software, version version 10.40, on January 13th, 2025. This update comes packed with powerful new features that make diagnosing and programming ECUs and TCUs easier and more efficient than ever. For those using launch diagnostic tools, this is a game changer. The update is compatible with devices such as the Launch X431 ECU slash TCU programmer, XProg3 and PC adapter, and the Launch X431 scanner integrated with XProg3. These tools work seamlessly together to deliver exceptional diagnostic capabilities. With this update, version version 10.40 introduces support for Mercedes-Benz TCU models VGS4-0 NG2 and VGS4-500 NG2, providing functions like reading, writing, personalization, and clearing data in boot mode. An exciting first for this lineup. Additionally, support has been expanded to include Cadillac and Chevrolet T87A transmission ECUs in bench mode, along with Great Wall transmission ECU, 7DCD450, and Engine ECUs MG1US00-1UA008 for Great Wall and Geely vehicles. Launch has also optimized data reading for BMW E83 models and enhanced the device's subscription handling ensuring that previously available functions remain accessible even after the free subscription expires. All in all, this update equips technicians with tools to tackle a broader range of diagnostic challenges with confidence. Now, let's delve into the step-by-step -step process of virginizing a Mercedes-Benz VGS 4 NAG2 TCU. This procedure is essential for resetting or erasing data from the fourth-generation 7-speed Mercedes-Benz gearbox enabling the TCU to be reprogrammed and adapted for replacement using MB Star. Whether you're working with a second-hand gearbox computer or resetting the original, this guide has you covered. To begin, start by selecting the appropriate ECU model. The Launch X431 software supports VGS4-0 NAG2 and VGS4-500 NAG2 gearbox types, so ensure you choose the correct one for your task. Once the model is selected, Review the wiring diagram provided within the software. This step is crucial as it outlines the connection process for the TCU. Depending on your requirements, you'll use either bench mode or boot mode. Bench mode is generally used to read data from the original gearbox computer, while both bench and boot modes must be connected for erasing and personalizing an external, secondhand TCU. After connecting the wires according to the diagram, Proceed by clicking Red TCU Information. This will allow the software to retrieve the necessary data from the original TCU. Next, you'll need to extract the EEPROM data. Begin by using Bench Mode to read the EEPROM data from the original vehicle's ECU. If Bench Mode fails to retrieve the data, switch to Boot Mode for a more direct approach. Once the original vehicle's data has been successfully read, it's time to erase the external TCU data. Connect the external gearbox computer using both bench and boot mode simultaneously, and then select the erase option. This will reset the TCU, making it ready for personalization. To personalize the TCU, choose the option to write the original vehicle's EEPROM data to the external TCU. After the process is complete, verify the personalization by clicking Read TCU Information once more to confirm the reset was successful. Finally, Reinstall the TCU into the vehicle and use MB Star for programming and coding. This step finalizes the process, ensuring that the newly virginized TCU is properly integrated with the vehicle systems. Following these steps will save you time 
and ensure a seamless transition when replacing or resetting a Mercedes-Benz TCU. Thank you so much for watching this comprehensive guide. If you found this tutorial useful, please smash that thumbs up button, leave a comment to share your experience, and most importantly, subscribe so you never miss out on the latest diagnostic tips and updates. For those who truly appreciate the effort we put into these videos, consider showing your support with a super thanks. It helps us continue creating valuable content for you. Until next time, happy diagnosing and keep your tools and skills sharp.